Welcome back to the final tutorial on how to create a piece of work in response to Louis Jove. And um, this time I've just got two more techniques that I want to show you. So you will then have all that you need to know. First thing we're going to do is we're going to add some dots to this big circle up here. Okay, so you're going to your pencil tool and you're going up and you're sliding the slider so it's nice and chunky and you can see how big it is when you slide it onto the work you can see how big the circle is going to be choose the color that you want in this case I'm going with white click OK and then it's literally a case of clicking and every time you click a dot will appear and you can fill the space as you see fit okay Okay, I'm sure you'll do a better job than me. Take a bit more time over that. Okay. And the last thing I wanted to show you was how to create a shape. In this instance, I'm going to do a circle in this area here um, without any color inside. So basically an empty line. Okay. So make yourself a new layer down the bottom left. And you're going to choose the marquee tool. And using shift, pressing shift, you're going to make yourself a circle drag to the size you want and first thing you're going to do is grab um, a colour, any colour you like, click OK and you're going to fill that space with that. OK? Then you're going to go over to the layer and you're going to right, uh, double click on it and you're going to go to stroke and that's, as you can see, it's going to give you a line around the piece you want to be about that many pixels, okay? Um, it's up to you, but around that many pixels is going to make the line the same as most. Um, and then what you want to do before you do anything else is right-click on that layer and rasterize it, okay? And that's going to take that layer and turn it into an image, like a just a basic flat image, at which point you can press delete and because you've still got the marquee there, it deletes the inside. And that's how you make yourself an empty shape. Now, of course, you can fill that shape with any colour you like now. But if you want to keep it empty, that's how to do it. Okay, and that is the last tutorial finished.